Now we can move on to our next section here in Mixpanel, uh, the user section, and we have a few options. The ability to look at individual users, uh, group them into cohorts, and then uh, another machine learning power report called Predict. Now, the first report, the Explore, is really just a way for us to filter through our users and then look at individual profiles. That's the main functionality we can do here. We can filter by people properties or by maybe events that they have done, right? Down here, we're looking at every single user. Um, the predict rate, actually, you know, this is something that, that came from uh, the predict report, which we'll see later on. That's here as a people property. And then once you, you know, once you have a specific user, you can just open their profile. So here's a specific profile we have here. And we can see their timeline, everything they have done, and their people properties here, and actually messages they have received or may have received or not, right? Um, typically, something like this can be quite helpful for custom support people, right? They can open up the profile of a user, see what they did, see what they didn't do, maybe what things they, they need to know before they respond to a ticket. Uh, so that use case, which I mentioned at the very beginning, can be uh, something that can be handled by something like this, right? Another interesting thing here is you can actually download the data as a CSV. Uh, I know typically a lot of marketing teams will say, hey, we have a group of users, maybe everyone who was onboarded, who has downloaded the iOS app, and who show interest in some specific future that's upcoming. We, you, know, you can quickly build that query up here, right, by using the events and people properties, and then you can just export that data and go send some kind of email campaign uh, in your email system. That's, of course, assuming you don't use Mixpanel to do that, which it's sometimes the case, right? Either way, it's a way for you to take the data with you and do something with it, right? You can also sort of select users, whether it's one by one all at a time, and then send messages, right? Uh, tied to, to the notification. So this is where you can start to do a lot of things quickly inside Mixpanel and send those notifications um, that you, that you, that you want to try out or experiment with based on the kind of criteria, right? So this is really a starting point for a lot of other things. Uh, and it's a way to, to look at individual users. For debugging too, also the profile is very helpful. Typically, we want to be able to come in and, you know, if, if it's a property, we want to be able to see all the events on the one user and all the information that we want to track, like names and emails and things like that should be here. Um, so this is also a very useful debugging tool. 